Hello and welcome to a new video on this YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you a playthrough of An Evil Existence, a horror game that came out the 18th of September 2020. I played this on the PlayStation 5 but it's the PlayStation 4 version because there is no PlayStation 5 version. Basically uh, An Evil Existence is a very janky clone I would say of not necessarily like a full-on clone but it feels like it's supposed to imitate some of the things from Resident Evil 7 I would say like typical family like stuff and you getting like punched down uh, like by a dude that even sort of looks like a discount version of Jack and all that sort of stuff and um, the game was a lot of fun to play through but it's not a good game don't misinterpret that even though the game was fun to play through that doesn't mean that it's a good game anyways hopefully you enjoyed the playthrough if you do consider leaving some sort of support in form of a subscription a like or something like that enjoy going to be one of those games isn't it the hartley twins jeffrey and kim were sectioned shh, at the age of 10 10 for attempting to kill one of their school teachers while in the hospital they confessed to having thoughts of killing another human being and fascinating uh, of eating humans to death 20 years later the hartley twins managed to kill eight hospital workers and escape to this day the hartley twins have never been seen or found the parents of the twins claimed the last time they saw the twins was two days prior to them escaping the hospital uh, when they went to visit them and even thought that the police performed a thorough search of the family's property no sign of the twins were ever found fuck me uh, unsolved mystery uh, stories uh, unsolved mysteries stories social media page creators holy shit what the fuck what is that sentence whatever i couldn't read the rest because of that sentence i didn't even have the controller in my hands so i'm not controlling anything here my cat has gone crazy as per usual incredibly long loading i'm getting more and more used to now not having like loading screens almost at all oh here we go this is the outlast if i've ever seen it Just to prove it to you guys, come over here and let me show you this old post box. That says the Hartley household. I definitely say we're at the right address. So we're going to go and have a look around. Wait, who the fuck is this guy? Follow James. Why is it twitching like this? Oh my god. Why is it doing that? What? Controls with two L's? Oh, uh, whatever. And I like that it flickers every time I, like, nudge down and, like, st stick, for st stick forward. It's like it goes, like, into a neutral position. That's different compared to my walking stance or something like that. I don't know. It's weird. <laughs> Okay, that's going to bother the shit out of me. Game runs very well, though. So far. I like that the dude that's with me doesn't say anything. It's... I'm not doing fine. That would be an overstatement. But I'm doing okay, I would say. We're playing a janky horror game today that spells controls with two L's. That's always a good start. And I don't know what to do. And I'm about two minutes into the game. And we have a dude with us that apparently films us because we're some sort of like... Take a look around the house. He's just supposed to stand there and I'm... Oh no. Can I toggle to run? Okay. Just tell me how the controls are. I can't do anything with the controls. Oh no, that's going to be a pain in the ass. I can't like toggle this to run. Clicking on the button.
Okay. <clears throat> because I usually like it when I can click. Welcome to the family, son. What? <laughs> oh my god. Game break? What is happening? Am I sniffing the wall? What is happening? Okay. Find a way out of the house. The nightmare begins. Oh boy. Auto saving. I need to hold the click button uh, down to run instead of just clicking it. That's so annoying. Whatever. I'm never going to get used to that in video games. When they do that. Can't run here. Okay. Hi, lady. He was very fast. Inspect. What the fuck? It, the inspect is not smooth. I need to like click every time I want to go one frame to the left. That's insane. It takes about half a year to turn it around because I can't hold it down to like turn it fast. I need to click it every time. Who does that? Use the key to unlock the garage locker. Okay. Probably going to be some cheap jump scares in this game, I would imagine. Oh my god. Yeah, <laughs> don't resist. <laughs> Might be something he likes, who knows. The wall looks frail, could be broken with the right tool. Oh boy. This is going to be... A beautiful game, I can already tell. Um. Do I need to go back to the garage? Maybe? They said that I was supposed- Look at this! Because of how the controls work, I start and stop all the time when I'm running. Why are you running? You owe me money. Why does this still have a prompt if it's- Okay, whatever. Stop asking questions. Wait, now he runs by clicking? No, now he always runs. He even runs when standing still. For some reason, I don't think it's supposed to be like this. Well, he's ready to move now. I'll take it. Oh my god. So he runs while standing still now. How have you been enjoying, uh, enjoying uh, Subnautica so far? I haven't watched too much of your playthrough. Even have the Founder's Badge. Hell yeah, babe. Oh, here we go. It's really cool. Yeah, I haven't been watching too much of your playthrough just because I'm like 
sort of very casually playing that game myself. <coughs> but I've seen uh, that you've been playing it from time to time. Like every Sunday or so, I'm assuming, since that's like usually your schedule. Cool below zero. <laughs> nice. What am I supposed to... Use the key to unlock the garage locker. What? Wait, hold on. Oh, nice. Yeah, of course. Yeah, because of the national stuff. Yeah, of course. That makes sense. Huh? It, it said that it was the wrong one. Like, 10 minutes before that. Can I stop that somehow? Yeah, we'd stop that somehow. By the way, this is brilliant how this game works like this. This is the second item that we can inspect. Uh, you can't hold down uh, the button to inspect it. I'm now holding it down and it clicks one frame uh, to the left. So if I want to like turn it 180, I need to click it. Okay, let's see. Let's Gain it back to neutral position. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 40, 37 times. I need to click the button. 37 times. If I want to turn it 180. Because I can't hold it down. That seems like perfect game design to me. I can attack in this game, though. Know? That's quite nice. Probably means there's enemies around now. <laughs> oh yeah, I still can't run here. It seemed like it was a mis uh, some sort of glitch that I was able to run here previously. Why is my character like limping? Imagine playing this in VR. Probably die from motion sickness. Fuck you. Wow. Okay. And the game, uh, the way the camera like twitches whenever you stop walking, it like goes back into a neutral stance with no frames in between. Where are my pills? What did she say? Where's my pills? Where are my pills? Oh boy. Resist being choked again? Wow, it's very dark in that place. Or is this a loading screen? Where are my pills? Nothing happened. Okay. Oh boy. What a game. Find a way out of the house. Find the missing jigsaw piece? Oh, okay. What does it say? Vinny's Pizza Place? Very original. Where are my pills? Wait. This entire... No, okay. Yeah, I can go here, probably. Yeah. Hammer smash face. Oh, no. Not really my type of music, to be honest. Can I, like, block somehow? Probably not.
That is Cannibal Corpse, right? Wait. Um, look at the shadow. Apparently I'm not holding the hammer. <laughs> Floating. Fine. Oh no, is there an objective? On top of the objective? Is this like a granny type of game? Because if it is... I don't think this is a game I'll complete. Oh my god, fuck. It is, probably. It really seems like it. Use? Use for the stairs. Wait, what? Okay. This is basically Resident Evil 7 also. Or what is happening here? <laughs> Find all the fuses. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay, clicking. Whenever I get chased in this game, I'm going to die like straight away. This is exactly like Resident Evil 7. <laughs> Wait, that is exactly like Resident Evil 7 as well. The hell is going on in this game? Is you drinking with someone that's... What is happening? What is happening with the amount of subs? <laughs> Toilet! Thank you so much for the resubscription as well for four months now with the primer ruse. Thank you! How are you today? Can this cutscene end soon? <clears throat> it's been three subs already. Or resubscriptions. That's insane. Boom! Doing laundry and other fun stuff. I'm doing okay. There's still some like medical issues that makes me feel like sick to my stomach uh, from time to time. But it hasn't been that bad today. And it like hurts my head like a shit ton. They have like sort of figured out but they're going to do more tests on it like the on the 11th of June But they've sort of figured out that I have migraines at least like a kind of aggressive migraines as well um, But they've also um, said that they think it's something else as well So it might be that my migraines are worse because of that thing They'll figure it out Unlock the bedroom door. Auto saving. That's nice. Door code 1918. Oh my god. Yes. It is better right now. It's a win in my book as well that I can actually do stuff. Look at this. This is so bad. I want to see what's on the other side. Ugh. Reminder. Do not forget, it's way too bright. Whatever. 1918. What's the camera? 4K? Nice. 4K grandma porn, here we go. Wait, is this like Resident Evil as well?
Am I going to play him now? Don't tell me. It does really seem like it. That was an auto saving point as well. And um, you know what the uh, the uh, under uh, title for this game is? Uh, you know that in the original Dawn of Dead. <clears throat> oh yeah. Um, <laughs> uh, it's uh, when there's no more room in hell, the dead will walk the earth. Is what it is in uh, the original Dawn of Dead. And in this game, it's when hell is full, uh, the evil will walk the earth. I wonder where I got that from. <laughs> it's a solo developer, so I guess I should cut him some slack. He has created one sin, though. Toilet paper is the shit. <laughs> he has done one sh very shitty thing. Because usually on PlayStation games, if you click the button, the like analog stick, whenever you run, it runs for you. You don't need to hold it down. Because that makes it incredibly uh, uncomfortable to hold on to the analog stick. But in this game, you need to hold it down and run forward. Or, and move forward at the same time. That's the only way he'll run. And you can't switch it either. That is super shitty. What? I can't move up and down? I can only move left to right. Or right to left. Boy. Accept. I need to press the exit button after that too. Hi. Gain access to the to the bedroom with a keypad lock. Yo, my dude. Happy hundred and tenth birthday. What the fuck? No, please. No. No. Okay, yeah, this is Resident Evil. Yeah. Fuck you, Grandma! Yeah. What riveting combat system! Yeah. <laughs> I guess that's true. Yeah. Uh, hey! She's, she looks like she's 150 years yeah. old. How many of these can she take? Grandma! Grandma! Uh, yeah. Okay, uh, yeah. it does look like I, I can just stand here and do this. There we go. Grandma is dead. Like, she just kicked open the door. <laughs> Fuse for the shutter door. Find all the fuses. Okay, that was the last fuse, apparently. Holy shit, what a game. Fucking it takes two. Move out of the way. Takes two, takes schmoo. I have nothing on this game. Escape. Oh, welcome to the family, son. <laughs> it is fucking Resident Evil. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's very true.
It's even this scene. <clears throat> nice ass, Grandpa. Hello, Professor, and welcome back. How are you today? Holy shit, it's incredible how bad this game is. It's a lot of fun, though, so far. <laughs> yeah, Biomutant is supposed to be uh, sort of bad from what I uh, heard from all the reviews. I usually don't listen to reviews, but when every single review says the same thing and every single Twitch streamer uh, that I look, um, uh, that I follow say the same thing and stuff, it's usually like an indicator that, okay, maybe the game isn't that good. What the fuck? Oh, they don't sell it in your country? That's weird. You want to talk? I guess not. What about you? Wait, isn't this the dude that we saw? In the video? Yeah, but I'm uh, also talking about uh, Twitch uh, streamers and stuff uh, as well. I saw that there was one dude that was um, um, even sponsored by a, a Biomutant or by the developers that said that the game was bad <laughs> because he usually doesn't take sponsorships unless he can say whatever he wants and they said that do whatever you want sort of and he said that the game was bad as well or not necessarily bad but it was like incredibly mediocre apparently Gate 2 and 5. Why would I want to do that? I'm turning so slowly. My turn rate is insane. Open all the gates to try to escape. Okay. Um, oh yeah, it should have been released today. Yeah. Yeah, that's very true. Uh, that is very true, Red. That is, uh, very weird. Yeah, so she's gone now. Baby Johnny. Baby Johnny. <laughs> Mommy will always love you. I think that was a sympathy card, what they call those. <laughs> Let's just say that this game has been like it. Very good at invoking emotions from me. Other than comical ones, I guess. It's weird that Biomutant hasn't been released in on the PSN store then. Yeah, because it should have been. Seeing that Biomutant has re has the release date today, right? For fuck's sake, this control scheme. Do I need to remember that? Yeah, it's out today? Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm not getting my copy, I think, before the 27th or something, according to Elchip. Wait, is that a green herb? That is a fucking green herb. <laughs> yeah, you can't find any information on it? Annabella Rhodes, tell my family I love them. Wow, what a trophy. 
hard earned trophy. Find a tool to break open the box. Okay. This is how fast I can, I can turn, by the way. This is how fast you turn in this game. There's no options to turn up the sensitivity or anything. <clears throat> Gate four and six. Propane. Propane, propane. What is that again? <gasps> Trailer park boys, right. I can see the game, but it says it's for pre-order? Really? That's weird. So four and six, so this thing opened. And... Fuck it, let's go here first. Propane, propane. What does it say on the release date then, if you like go into the store page of it? Does it say the 25th? What the fuck? That's weird. Okay. What? <laughs> huh? They randomly took HP away from me. And then she disappeared or she like was crawling on the floor <laughs> what a game dude what a game like i said game of the year easily fuck okay hold on i think i need my um uh thingy to write on uh because we found like green one was one. Oh my god i've almost used this entire thing now hold on Okay, so green one, and that was blue three, or something like that. <clears throat> you can envy that they write controls with two L's. Yeah, blue three, okay. Seems, this game seems so good, dude. Best game ever made. Jump scare? Missed opportunity? Oh, here we go, yeah. <laughs> yeah, nine. A solid nine. I was expecting a jump scare there when we walked past the corpses. The running part of the game makes my hand hurt. That's always a good sign. By the way, bolt cutters is um, a very normal item in Resident Evil as well. <laughs> Full metal jacket? Is it the um, yelling scene or something? We need to go to four, I would imagine. Turns so... Low. Yeah, let me see your warface. Yeah. <laughs> ah! You are a pussy. Show me your warface. Did we ever go here? You know what this game could have used? A map. Here we go. Seven. Red seven. I can guess the last one now. Trust Peacock? What, what is that? <clears throat> seven. Lucky seven. Huh? That was it? A trust pilot. Oh. 
I found one of the numbers. 1.3. Jesus. Because I need to go back now. Because we can just guess the last number if we wanted to. I would imagine. Have I been here? Oh yeah, we have. I'm a fawn! <laughs> Why is it so hard to run? What? Oh, there we go. Let me guess. Yep. Same fucking system. Three. One. Seven. Let's say it's nine for the yellow one. Boom. Damn it. Let's just go like this then, I would imagine. Fuck. And it... <sighs> it's so fucking delayed whenever you use the analog stick. Okay, denied. Okay. Thank you, Majiggy. I'm sorry about that. You know what? Fuck it. I'll test zero. Nope. Yes! Work out the code for the hall gate. 911. Oh, it's a green herb again. Like that it's set. It's even a first aid kit here, and we use the herb instead. Whatever. Don't question this shit. Let's go with it. Gate 7. Okay. Ice hockey. Hi. Oh, I didn't even do that. Axe? Just an axe. A helpful weapon and tool. Oh, you won over Sweden. Nice. I've never paid much attention to ice hockey. A farm! Whoever invented this sort of uh, running mechanism needs to be fired. I can see why. Competitive sports are always fun to watch, so. Oh! Why is it just. Oh no, she's sucking me off! Is that supposed to be Mia? <laughs> that was the scene with Mia, apparently. <laughs> yeah, this is a brilliant game, isn't it, OCD? <laughs> One of the better games I've ever played, right? Class 88. <laughs> Fucking running is going to like make my arthritis even worse. The fact that I need to click the button down so hard <laughs> just to run in this game. Pick lock. Okay. Open the drawer with a pick lock. Welcome to hell. I'm at fault. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, a key. Safe? What's safe? Um. I'm any halvete. Oh. Is she going to, like, come into the cutscene again? Oh boy. Hmm? Oh, brilliant. Is the suspenseful music going to be this the entire way through now? Oh, I'm auto running again. This game, dude. Gotta get a move on ass. Well, she's ready for something. Ooh, nice. But I don't need that yet, though. I probably need it after the. Why is she lying like a starfish? She died the way she was, like a starfish. The prompt is over here. <laughs> It's not even on the thingy. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Oh no, she's standing up again. Hello. Never mind, I guess. Used to give medical treatment. Used. Him. Yeah. Okay, three and seven. That means the dude in the very first cell. Upskirt. Wait. Her legs is cut off. No wonder she didn't get too far. Wait. <gasps> Can I clip through the door? Uh oh, I think I'm stuck. Okay. Huh? There's no prompt here, but I need to use something here. Or... X! X is the menu! X! Fucking X is the menu! Who uses that as a menu button? What? It's not! Huh? There is a prompt over there that I can't see. I... whatever. So, is there a prompt on her, too? Huh? Farm, uh, use the fucking kit? Oh, no. But the prompt has disappeared now. That's going to make this game a whole lot more difficult. Oh, there we go. Oh, so that's when she stands up. Pistol. What is happening? He used like 10 years to shoot. What the fuck? I know you're in here, so just show yourself. When I click the button, it takes three seconds for him to shoot. That's insanity. Hello?
Oh, there we go. Bit rusty on the aim there. Hello, Mother. Oh, welcome back. How are you today? Game is brilliant, dude. 10 out of 10. No Apex aim. <laughs> Playing with a controller and this game is like terrible. Look at this. Okay, I'm going to try to so that you can see when I whenever I click this now. It takes like a second or two before he actually shoots. <laughs> oh. Pistol bullets. You reload with circle, not square. Huh? No time to question this shit. Another brilliant cuts the scene. Let me out! Help! Let me out! Oh my god! Stay hydrated right after I took a sip, you bastard! <laughs> I would say that that has been our um, objective. More in more than one kit. Really? <laughs> okay. There seems to be some sort of flammable substance poured everywhere. Where did he come from? Oh, wow, that's so loud. And we're dead, but not pronounce you are or your with like the R E thing, um, because it's an L T D. Is it from the B series? Because mine is B two fifty five. I think mine is two fifty five. Uh, B two fifty five. Yeah, I think. I'm auto running now. By the way. Which is nice. Yeah, B205, yeah. So it's from the B series. I'm dead. Yep.
So I think that this <clears throat> entire section is um, just a like try and fail sort of thing. Trial and error, it's called. You just need to like die over and over again to memorize wherever you're supposed to go. Oh, okay. There was three sections I could go here as well. Never play with fire. It's going to be a body in the water. Because it was in Resident Evil 7. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's very true, Professor. No body? I'm shocked. I wonder if there's some sort of logic to why these people are doing this. Or if it's just a standard, we're crazy. That's why. And why are all these things underneath the house in the first place? Hanging with the dead people? <laughs> Restring streams uh, and all that sort of stuff uh, from Red is always like very chill. Old hand torch will be a handy tool if you can light light the torch I'm a farm for it though they found a thousand Yeah, of course, there's more smoke there now for some reason. Ah, oh, smoke out the bees! Use honey to heal your burns. What? Whatever. No time to question this shit. Gain access to the cemetery. Like that they don't react at all. <clears throat> Jesus. Interesting. That was it? Whatever? What? <laughs> Holy shit, I uh, replayed with Nurse Lar uh, the other day. Um, papers, please. What a good game that is. So simple, yet so addicting. Yeah? There's a nun now, for some reason. Bed- the bedroom corpse. Well, John Martin, the father to Ada Hartley, the Hartley mother. Yeah, okay, it's impossible to inspect things in this game. Hello!
What am I supposed to do here? Just get out of the cemetery? Thank you. The non ghost. <laughs> Keys to a delivery van, sure dude, whatever. Wait, he was just chilling down there? Okay. Kill the twin brother. Wait, what? How? Uh oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck again. Thankfully, he's waiting for me. He like sees that I'm having trouble. Um. I think we may have a problem here. Uh oh. Hey, uh, can you come over here? I need some help. Oh no! <clears throat> I'm stuck. Oh, there we go. Nice. Thank you. You don't need to come now, though. Okay, so there's something over here that I can use, maybe. But it seems to be, like, a very specific pattern that you need to go through. Are you fucking serious? I actually like that they do get stun locked though, because that means that you won't get cheap shots in every time. This is sort of nice. Because that's fucking annoying. You missed me. Um. Because I need to find more of these. There's a. Like, it's very difficult to run on command in this game. Because clicking down the button, it might be easier on PlayStation 4. But holding down the run button is incredibly difficult on PlayStation 5. Fuck! Yeah. So the entire thing here is just to run around and look or pickable objects. That's nice. I'm back at the start now. Is that one? Burning my hand, by the way. Like running. Thank you, Elwood. I have a lurk command now. 
Thank you for the lurk support. Oh no. Oh, there we go. Hopefully this is the last one. Oh, stop him. Yeah. Die by the broken cross. Oh, shit. Where was the door out again? I'm at... It feels like I'm destroying my controller because I need to press it down so hard. That's what she said. There's Dungeons and Dragons tomorrow. There might be one on Thursday. I'll keep you guys updated on social media things. It depends on how I how I feel on uh, Thursday because I don't trust my health anymore. Seems to be very based on day-to-day -day stuff. Okay. I could be feeling okay one day and the next day I feel like shit all of a sudden. It hurts my hands so much to just run. It's insane how hard you have to like press the button down. Boom boom. Oh, she one shots me. That's going to be annoying. The existence is evil. Connor, hello and welcome back. How are you today? Hopefully, you're doing fine today. The existence is evil, indeed. going okay uh, I do have health issues uh, that comes back uh, like a lot nowadays that's why I haven't been streaming as much but hopefully they'll get sorted with time and I'm feeling okay today that's why I decided to stream today okay Wait. Okay, so I'm not supposed to do anything with that one. Yeah, I hope so too. Yeah, it's been some weird issues with like my head and stuff. But I think it's migraines when it comes to my head, but that they think it's something else that's wrong too. That they're going to try to check out more on the 11th. Because they do really think that I uh, have migraines. And I sort of think that myself too, reading more uh, about migraines, but I have like issues breathing normally and stuff. But we'll see. And uh, acid reflux, which makes me nauseous. Yeah, they're going to do that at some point, yeah. 
like an MRI of the head. Oh, here we go. Holy shit. Get out of here before the whole place blows up. Welcome to the family, son. Again. Holy shit. Why? Gaelic? Yeah, that was insane, Professor. Holy shit. Yeah, that was ear fuck 3000. They're going to inject me with something now. So it turns out that I've been dead all along. I'm back in one of these places again. Oh my god, dude. Oh, Jesus! I'm not expecting jump scares in this game. Every jump scare seems to be confined, like, into a, uh, to a cutscene so far. <laughs> so I'm not expecting jump scares. Oh, I'm a farm! <laughs> Yeah, horror games are always a lot of fun. Just that some of the janky ones, I do l like to play the janky horror games, but some of them have like incredibly uh, irritating uh, elements to them as well. If they were just janky, that would have been fun. But some of them are so like annoying to play. This one hasn't been too bad, but the fact that I need to hold down the L3 button to run, not just click it, but hold it, like fucks my hand over. He spelled it with one L in the actual control thingy. And he spelled it with two L's here. Yeah, whatever. Okay, we don't need that now. That's a green herb, by the way. It's so subtle, their uh, influence. It's a green herb. <laughs> oh, I need his... Wait! Wait! Is this going to be a chainsaw battle? Don't tell me that this is going to be a chainsaw battle. No, it's not. What is it doing? <laughs> Okay, bye. See ya. Yeah, but the cool thing usually about like indie horror titles is that they can like do whatever they want, basically. So they, uh, a lot of times they make more like horror games compared to uh, AAA titles. AAA titles try to, like for Resident Evil, for example, I do really, really like Resident Evil. But it tries to like appeal to a broader audience, so there's so so much action in the games as well. That's some of the cool stuff with indie horror games. That some of them are just flash, uh, plain all horror games. Even though I do hate the horror games that I where I can't defend myself, they are always sort of annoying to me. Because I've, I've just been, uh, I've been raised like uh, within uh, a horror uh, place where you can actually uh, usually defend yourself in some sort of manner with like Resident Evil, Silent Hills, those sorts of titles. I don't think he's going to come for me. So. Yes, indeed. I usually like to uh, be able to defend myself in some sort of manner. Which you can't do in like Amnesia, Outlast. It's always like run, hide. 
Oh, you're playing Days Gone. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I think I'm going to play it at some point myself, considering that I got the game for free. Oh, Kniefor. We got the Knief. What is he doing, by the way? Backstab. Yeah. Riveting gameplay, by the way. Car just floats. <laughs> Alright, let's get the herb and get out of here. Intense duel. <laughs> what do you think about Days Gone so far? Is it enjoyable? What the? F A lot of them. Um, and then it was like the free game with plus at some point as well. Yeah, underutilized. Yeah, that's what I've heard as well, that it feels like a missed opportunity and sort of generic. It, because it feels like you do the same stuff over and over and over and over again, apparently. Why am I so... Am I uh, crouching? Feels like I'm so far to towards the ground. I think we've gotten shorter during the playthrough. But the story's worth it so far? Okay. Yeah, like I said, I'll play through it at some point. I don't know when it will be, though. Yeah, we've definitely gotten shorter, by the way. There's no way we were this short, like, 10 minutes ago. Weird. Oh, so there's actual camps and stuff. Yeah, because there isn't like an oh, um, uh, it is uh, like an open world sort of what the fuck Oh My knife disappeared when I uh, Equipped the flamethrower I don't have the knife anymore. What the fuck is that? The flamethrower! <laughs> we got it. Okay. Go kill mommy now. Oh, hi. Oh, wow. Those are some really good effects. With the right tool? Why is it so dark here now? Can I pick it up from here? Oh wow, I could. Okay, nice. Come here, grandma. <laughs> I think grandma is fucked. And I'm not hurting her either. It's time to burn. What is this game? <laughs> An 
again. Blender Photoshop. Yeah, this was one of the longest games we ever played, right? <laughs> I can't even read what's on here. It's way too far away. Swamp House Starter Kit was one of the assets that was here.